Hi, it's Mark, Golden State AV Videos, and we're here today, February 18th, 2023, at Wood Lake Airport. And uh, this is an airport uh, kind of at the foot of the Sierras, as you can see. It has a 2,203 foot runway, 50 feet wide. You can see the hangars. Fuel facility. There is a cafe which uh, closes at two o'clock in the afternoon. It's called the Runway Cafe. I'll just pan around. Popular spot. And you can see the Sierras have quite a bit of snow on them. Uh, also, the orange harvest is coming in. Saw quite a few orange trees on the way out here. It's about 20 minutes east of Visalia, California. And uh, elevation is 425 feet. Let me just pan around so you can see the windsock. And as I said, the uh, runway configuration is uh, runway seven heading east and two five going in a westerly direction. I'll also show you the beacon. If I can get it, let's see if I can get it in here. Actually, I don't think I can unless I take it off the tripod. The facility you see over there is a wastewater treatment facility for the city of Woodlake. It's a little community in the foothills. And right now I'm just waiting for an aircraft. I, I just don't know if we'll see anything. Uh, Woodlake does have a chapter of the EAA. There's their building. And we'll just kind of wait around, see if we can see anything take off or land. I'll also go over to the other side so you can see the other hangars. Uh, temperature today is about mid 60s, virtually just a little bit of wind out of the uh, east. No clouds visible.
and as you can see, um, Sierras have a lot of snow. I saw more coming over here. Just going to pan around so you can get a little bit of a closer view of the Sierras. And this is the gateway to Sequoia National Park and Kings Canyon National Park. So you, Wood Lake is off of uh, Highway 198 and 198 goes, leads into the road to the park both parks. I'm going to take a look at that twin. It's an old uh, uh, Piper. We can take a look at the inside just or being, you know, we don't want to get too close, but I can at least give you some idea. Everybody's heading home from the cafe. They just closed. It's about uh, 3.12 in the afternoon, and they closed at 2, so everybody's heading home. I'm going to just pick up the camera, and uh, you'll be able to see this uh, piper. Well, it's a turbo Aztec. Okay, so you can see the end number on it, so we can look it up and see how old it is. does not look like it's in flying condition, judging by the tires. Let me just swing around. And then we have an, uh, a similarly older Cessna 150. Even though it's pretty dead now, uh, this can be a very busy airport earlier in the day on a weekend. 
A lot of people just fly in here for breakfast or lunch. It's a quick flight from all the major cities in the Central Valley, Visalia, Fresno, Hanford. So it's a popular little place to come to and easy to navigate. Let me get another shot of the Sierras from this vantage point. We've really had good rain and we're expecting more next week. I wouldn't say the drought is over, but uh, at least it helps. Let's get another, since the Aztec is kind of unusual, let's get another view of that. Let me just come around. Kind of a nice twin. Can't quite, I can see into the cockpit. I can see the instrumentation, but I don't know if I can show it to you with the camera. Let me see if I can get the camera off the mount and maybe I can show you that. Well, you get some idea. A nice uh, analog panel. You can seat six people. Two here, two here, and of course two up front. Let's get a view from the rear. Well, it may not be a lot of action, but at least uh, we've got some antique planes not literal antiques, but older planes, part of uh, private aircraft history. And then let's walk over to the 150, I think it's a 150 or 152. Yeah, it's 150. There's a nameplate. Well, they seem pretty tiny and fragile, but it's actually a very nice plane to fly, and I've flown in them. And uh, it's a little tight. You can see the Seats are close together, but uh, it flies really well and it's a nice plane and affordable. A new Cessna 172 is 400000 plus dollars. You know, these are still affordable. There's a better view of the cafe. I 
I'll get you some specs on both the 150 and the Piper Aztec Turbo so you'll know how high they can fly, how fast, range, that kind of thing. Okay, so I'm going to wind up this segment with a shot of the Sierras. And then I'm going to walk around and see if I can find something on the hangar, uh, hangars on the other side.